Hey there, this is Koi, rocking the Butter Sword, and this is going to be a little guide for tree poles. So tree poles are special trees in the game that reward you for having killed enemies. And it, the reward that it spits out is based on how many enemies you've killed and how well you've killed them. There are three tiers, which in the vanilla game are progressive, between green, blue, and red rupees. But in randomizer, each tier is independently randomized, which means the easiest tier to get to could have the best reward or it could have the worst reward. And the only way to find out what they are is to pull it. There is no progression whatsoever. It could be bombs, fairies, and rupees. Or it could all be bombs. They could all be single green rupees. It's all completely random, which is why we love randomizer. So the three poles are tier one, which is to kill between one and three enemies. And that'll get you that tier one pole. And you do have to screen transition in between poles or it won't work. Tier two is to kill one, two, three, and aggro. Four enemies and to take damage. So if you've, killed, if you've killed four or more enemies and took damage, you'll get tier two, which is blue rupees. Screen transition again. And tier three is to kill four more enemies and take zero damage. One, two, three, four. Now we'll get red rupees. So that's how you get those tree poles. Real simple, right? Uh, so typically, your first tree pole would be outside the uncle. So let's flute over there real quick. So in typical routing, when you do like the, the uncle start, which is uh, pretty popular, you come up here and since you have no weapon, you pick up this sign. And we're gonna use this sign to kill a blue guard. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Boop. And you can pull the tree and get your tier one pull. Easy peasy, right? The next place you would normally use a tree pole was uh, where we just were, coming out of Sanctuary. I don't really feel like saving and quitting, we'll just dash over there. Um. But uh, you can kill a green guard with a sign, or one of the buzz blobs with a sign, or kill a green guard in the uncle drop with a pot, because this does persist through save and quit. We're gonna kill this buzz blob. You can get a tier one pole right here. Why didn't I... Why didn't it pull? I just killed him. Okay, I don't know. That was weird. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, and then the next place you can do a tree pull is right outside the thieves' hideout. So we'll kill this, uh... Let's kill this guy. Whoa! This tree right here, next to the Thieves' Hut entrance. Thieves' Hut entrance. Also a tree pull tree. And the last one that you'd ever really use in Randomizer, and typically you'd only use this one in uh, inverted mode, is in the Dark World. Unfortunately, it's really hard to kill Dark World enemies at the beginning of the game in inverted. Uh, there's no real, like, ideal way to do it. I like throwing bushes at the, uh, the Ropa right outside Link's house. But we'll just, we'll just swipe something real quick. Like, that guy. This one right here is a tree pole. Nice way to maybe get some early bombs or rupees in inverted. But that's, uh, tree poles, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have a wonderful day.